Hi everyone, it's Wednesday, it's a new comic book day. Went by my local comic shop and I picked up some single issues. Um, there was also a package waiting for me uh, that arrived in the mail um, with some books that I'm going to show you today too. So, um, first up, um, Star Trek Green Lantern issue 1. I missed out on the first issue, so I picked it up today. Like you can see on the cover, um, it's the Star Trek crew from the recent movies with Chris Pine and Zoe Saldana and all the other actors um, then issue 2 um, Bill and Ted's Most Triumphant Return issue 6 of 6 so now I, now I have the entire miniseries and then Grant Morrison's 18 Days issue 2 um, I picked up the first issue, haven't read it yet um, the art looks promising and from what I've read by Grant Morrison thus far I I enjoy his writing so I guess I will enjoy his writing in this series too I like the colors um, that's it for single issues for this week then like I said there was a package waiting for me in the mail um, first up is the Ultimate Collection uh, Tour by Kieran Gillen this is a nice thick book with uh, the entire run by Gillen by Gillen yeah um, and it says on the back collecting tour 1966 Issue 604 through 614, Siege, Loki, and the New Mutants, uh, issue 11, written by Kieran Gill. So I can't wait to get into this. Um, there was a summer sale, so I, the, all the books that you're going to see now uh, were extremely cheap, um, and I, I've been wanting to uh, get more into Tor. Uh, and other new characters that I haven't read any comics about recently so I decided to pick it up um, then Thor and Loki Blood Brothers which is, an, which is a hardcover because I'm uh, trying out new characters I decided to pick up some uh, self-contained stories or entire runs like the ultimate collection um, yeah then uh, I have the Avengers Prime premiere edition hardcover which is um, a little story surrounding Iron Man, Thor and Captain America Um, I believe that uh, this is a story after Siege, kind of a bonding story for the three characters. I can't say for sure, but I think that's what I read online. It's a story by Brian Michael Bendis, so I'll probably read Siege before I read this. Um, then the two biggest hardcovers I picked up um, The Avengers Disassembled, The Invincible Iron Man, The Mighty Thor and Captain America so this isn't the uh, Avengers Disassembled book but the book surrounding the same three characters as The Avengers Prime book um, this again was, uh, it's, it's got a, 99, a 94 uh, 0.99 dollars cover price and I picked it up for less than half so really glad I decided to pick up some sales um, this collects store issue 80 through 85 Iron Man 84 uh, through 89 Captain America and the Falcon 5 through 7 and Captain America 29 through 32 29 to 32 um, nice cover 
and great back over with Captain America and uh, the Scarlet Witch. Didn't know that they had a thing. I know she had a relationship with the Vision, but apparently she had something going on with Captain America too. Looking forward to reading this too. I plan on uh, picking up the Avengers Disassembled uh, book by its own too. Uh, then the Dark Avengers by Brian Mc Michael Bendis. Now cover edition. Nice thick book. Uh, this collects Dark Avengers 1 through 6 and 9 through 16 and Animal Number 1. Um, I've been meaning to uh, read up on the big Marvel events and um, important uh, yeah, events in the Marvel Universe. So, Dark Avengers, Siege. I know Siege. Uh, doesn't doesn't uh, hasn't got the best reputation, but I still want to read it. Um, and Dark Avengers is another book I wanted to read, so picked it up again at a discount price and with a nice uh, back cover with Norman Osborn as Spider-Man. Like you can see, these are all oversized hardcovers, except for the. Um, Avengers Prime one. These will look great on my shelves. Uh, I'm looking forward to picking up some new shelves um, because I'm not entirely happy with my without the books are ordered right now. So um, when I get some new shelves, probably next month, um, I'll be able to rearrange my books and hopefully um, have a better nicer setup um, but that's going to take some work uh, I have to rearrange my, ro my room my room here and um, get rid of some other shelves to make room for the new shelves I'll probably buy some KLX uh, IKEA shelves um, they look very sturdy and I've talked to a lot of people who Collect collected editions like uh, I do, um, and they're really happy with uh, the Gal the Galax shells from IKEA. So I'll probably get the smaller ones to uh, put my TV on, and then have some books underneath, or I don't know. We'll see. I'm thinking out loud here. So um, thanks again for watching. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing what you guys picked up. Um, if you have some questions about what I picked up or recommendations, um, or if you want to see one of these books from up close uh, or in more detail, um, leave comments in the comment section below and just let me know. Uh, I always enjoy reading your comments. Uh, thanks for watching again. Um, talk to you guys next time. Bye.